Hello, everyone, and welcome to AGI Denim's presentation at Kingpins 24. The world is currently looking very divided from our perspective. We feel it is more important than ever to promote unity and hope that you would agree. To do our small part from within the industry, we are sharing our platform at Kingpins 24 with other denim community leaders to share some of our success stories in the hopes that we can inspire others. Their success story is about fiber, fabric, and finish can hopefully serve as useful takeaways for others to implement their own initiatives. Our industry is not perfect, but neither is denim. And perhaps that is why we can cherish the beauty of imperfection in our genes. The way denim is currently produced is not perfect or sustainable, but we at AGI Denim strive to make changes daily. We are hopeful there will be a sustainable future that includes denim. It means we have to do our part as an industry, as countries, as professional, and as companies. As you're watching this, consider the changes you can make because we are all connected and the choices we make can have large changes beyond even our own consumer choices. We've always believed in tangible steps and we are honest in admitting we as a company too have some ways to go, but we're not shying away from investing back into our business to really get to the level we need to be at. It takes years of effort and constantly plowing back into the business to bring about meaningful change. However, by installing the right machinery, building our infrastructure, investing in renewable energy and water stewardship, we hope to do our part as a family business for our future generations. We hope you will enjoy the rest of this segment. Really good advice from the beginning to make sure that our the pigment fit into existing manufacturing systems, you know, no upfront cap X was required at the mill to adopt it. And then, you know, kind of thinking through just the layers of how to get to the end goal and working backwards, I started thinking about waste and really the only way to make it cost competitive with something as cheap as oil is to use trash. <laughs> Hi, my name is Carl Chiara, um, Global Creative Director of AGI Denim. I'm excited to talk with one of our um, partners, Jane Palmer of Nature Coating. Jane is an innovation leader um, in plant-based sustainable dyes for over 15 years, and I'm excited to, to talk with Jane about Nature Coating. Nature Coatings transforms wood waste into high-performing black pigments. So basically, we work with sustainable forests, um, FSC certified forests, and we use their waste products, such as little tiny branches or bark. And then we take that waste product and we transform it into black pigment. And the black pigment is a bio-based, you know, renewable alternative to petroleum-based carbon black pigment. So we found that our pigment can be used almost anywhere black pigment is being used as a replacement. You know, it's been really great because I feel like both sides have a system set up to be able to fast track this type of adoption. So for example, from you know, my perspective, AGI asked for samples very quickly. They were able to test the samples really quickly. They were able to show their customers very quickly, look, this is an alternative solution. Um, and that process went very fast. On our side, Nature Coating side, we develop this product for easy adoption. Our product comes in a liquid or water-based dispersion or concentrated ink. It can be mixed directly into existing formulations. It's used with existing printing or coating equipment. And it's really as easy as just grabbing our pigment off the shelf versus the petroleum option. In terms of performance and cost, you know, we're very comparable, if not better, to petroleum carbon black pigment. Our pigment's very high performing. It doesn't fade in the sun. It's not affected by sweat or humidity. So it's very stable. It's uh, cost neutral for comparable grades of petroleum carbon black pigment. Petroleum carbon black is made by literally burning oil. <laughs> Compared to that, our manufacturing process is closed loop and the only emission is steam from the water from the trees. And we're actually able to capture that steam and use it to power the equipment. So our process, manufacturing process is very clean. It has the potential to save millions of tons of CO2 
from entering the atmosphere. Like what's next for nature coding? Like where are you taking this? Our business is one of scale. We're really finding that our pigment is a great direct replacement for anywhere petroleum carbon black pigment is being used. So that would include, um, you know, I'm looking behind you and I can see black painted bookshelves. It would be appropriate for that. It'd be appropriate for, you know, glasses frames, for all different types of ink, for food packaging, for auto, automobile, um, auto applications. And we're really looking at exploring all those different markets. You know, our plan is to become the experts in black, in bio black, and to really replace as much of the petroleum option out there across all industries. Wow. I, mean, I know you touched on it a little bit earlier, but I'm, I'd like to just go back to what it was like working with AGI just a little bit. Well, as I mentioned before, I met from AGI at Kingpins about a year ago. And what was really great about AGI and is that there's just a level of persistence of checking in frequently. What, you know, when can we do this? How can we do it? Let's get it started. And then it was a matter of just working. We got introduced to the people at the mill, working then directly with them to send them samples. Then they were able to quickly go through and test the different products. I think what's great about AGI is that they have a really large customer base who can move potentially more quickly than other brands in the marketplace. I knew from the beginning is that I wanted to create the most impact as possible. And the way to do that would be create something that performs as well, that's in the market, that's cost neutral, that has the cherry on top of being, you know, really better for our environment and our health. Hi. I am Ali Tekin from AGI Denim. Lycra has been a leader in defining how jeans fit for decades, and they are a valued partner for AGI Denim. We are so excited to have them share some of uh, their ideas with us today. We encourage and promote all the challenges to the old way of doing things, work towards a better way of making denim. Hi Ali, great to see you. I'm Rita Ratzkoff, Senior Strategic Account Manager for the Lycra Company. Um, so at the Lycra Company, we innovate and produce high quality, differentiated fiber and technology solutions that are designed to meet consumers' needs for comfort, fit, and lasting performance. AG Denim has run approximately 2 million units of jeans with uh, body scalping functions powered by T400 with one major US clients. Can you talk how Lycra collaborated with that project and how are you working with to, to these products to evolve, make the lower impact to the environment? So the Sculpt product uses our Lycra Beauty technology, which is part of Lycra Dual Effects technology portfolio. And AGI Denim was one of the first to use that product. And we worked very closely with you on the development. This uses both our Lycra fiber and our Lycra T400 fiber in a patented dual core application. Fabrics using Lycra dual effects technology are designed to comfortably shape and sculpt your curves. In addition to testing for stretch and recovery, we also test Lycra Beauty fabrics for restraining force and power to ensure the fabrics have enough power to hold and shape, but not too much power to be uncomfortable. Now more than ever, consumers are saying that comfort is key along with durability. AGI Denim has had great success with this product at multiple key denim retailers. So we have a portfolio of EcoMade products that are focused on waste reduction and fabrics using Lycra Dual Effects technology can be upgraded with our sustainable fibers while maintaining the same fabric performance. Our Lycra EcoMade fiber is partially made from pre-consumer waste. Lycra fiber waste is collected at our manufacturing sites and blended with virgin polymer at specific concentrations. Our Lycra T400 EcoMade fiber is made from a combination of recycled PET, plastic bottles, and plant-based materials. Both of these fibers are GRS certified. Doing the calculations on the AGI denim fabric, 
about three plastic bottles could be diverted from landfills for each pair of jeans. So your estimate, Ali, of running approximately 2 million yards of fabric, well, you can do the math and see you would be diverting millions of bottles from landfills, and that's really significant. I recently launched a new uh, product. What is anti-slip lycra, and how you are working with AGI denim yeah, so we are very excited about the recent launch of our new Lycra anti-slip fiber. This new fiber is the solution to the key issue of spandex slippage in single core fabrics. Polyviscose, rayon blends, and cellulosic fabrics have become more and more popular, but they have a higher propensity for fiber slippage. And this is a problem for consumers because they get that unsightly ripple. It could be damaging to brand and retailers image and it's been a nightmare for mills as well. And we've already seen a very positive reaction from brands and retailers that are eager to start developments. AGI Denim is one of the first mills to be on board developing samples. And we definitely have new things that will be coming down the line in the next year in 2021 as well. So stay tuned. We have a long history with AGI Denim of working together on our new developments. And we look forward to continuing to develop products together that are going to meet consumer needs. Welcome, my name is Emma Javed. I'm an executive director at AGI Denim. And today we're in conversation with Genealogia. So, hi, Fernando. Hi, hello. This is Fernando from Genealogia. Well, I am the person in charge of Brainbox department that is uh, basically a department of the garment finishing developments in, in Genealogia. EIM is one of those softwares that, you know, has really changed the way we measure the impact on the industry. Um, initially, it was developed as a tool for just suppliers to gauge, you know, what are the different processes that they're putting into their product. But now, you know, over the years, you've managed to make it the global standard of, of impact assessment of a product. So it comes from, a, from an internal need. Basically, it's a, measure, it's a measure tool and it comes, we use it to know and to understand our consumptions and our savings with our, with our own processes and, and development. At that moment, there wasn't anything like this in the market. And then we decided to, to share and to donate it to, to, to the rest of the, of the industry. Today, more than 50 brands and more than 200 uh, laundries are uh, users of, of, of EIM. So today it has become uh, a standard in the industry. This year, 2020, we launched um, our new software designer. It's a software that, that simplifies the process of making laser files, but also it gives us the opportunity, it gives us the chance of making a digital sample collections will mean that we will be able to save a lot of samples. We will be able to save, to save a lot of um, a lot of time. It's a great new tool that we have launched in this 2020. But also we are we are working in in some new exciting processes with our G2 Ocean systems and with our eFlow to avoid the use of pumice stones. EGI and Genealogy are, are working now together on this to implement this uh, in the industry and in the market. And this is one step more for, I think, for our common uh, mission zero of, and the detoxify the, 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 the industry. So I think uh, the relationship between AGI and Genealogy has always been a two-way relationship. We've always collaborated on a number of projects. I remember us collaborating on uh, one bo bottle, one garment concept, you know, for one of our strategic customers, uh, they wanted to have a very, very low impact garment. And I remember the genealogia technicians being down here, the brand technicians being down here, and us just really creating magic in, in the laundries. I am Ali Tekin, and I'm the director for AGI Denim. AGI Denim has a unique technology called Double Zero. It completely eliminates wastewater in both indigo dyeing and fabric finishing. It also saves more than 80% from the conventional denim indigo denim fabrics. AGI Denim selected Dye Star pre reduced liquid indigo for this project. We are excited to share this success story with the all corners of the denim industry to get better denim production.
We are proud to be joined by Dai Star. Good day, everyone. My name is Faisal Mumtaz, Managing Director of Dai Star Pakistan. I have led the organization since 2010. Dai Star has been around in Pakistan since 1995 and is the market leader of Indigo products for the textile industry. Over the past decade, Dystar has actively supporting the supply chain and customers with sustainable products and innovation solutions. Dystar Cold Denim product is our Dystar Indigo 40% solution, the cleanest Indigo in the market. The product represents the state of the art in pre-reduced Indigo liquid. The reduction is realized by hydrogenation Dystar production site. It allows a cleaner denim production and shows a massive positive impact on resource efficiency, such as reduction of sodium hydrosulfide, usage by 60 to 70 percent, much cleaner wastewater and less water usage. The global share of the pre-reduced indigo is about 70 percent outside of China. Including China, it's less than 50 percent. When we compared the powder, the liquid, the liquid provides a direct 70 percent saving of hydrosulfide, 60% of caustic semi-automatic dosing system as a ready-to-use product. The load of ETP is drastically reduced. Even with the dark shades, it has a huge positive impact on ETP in terms of TDS, BOD, and CODs. Thank you, Mr. Faisal, for all the information. You. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you so much for tuning in. On behalf of all of us at AGI Denim family, stay strong, stay positive, peace and love.